boy Cleave is back. The rap game really need this crack. I'm finna get me a bag. I'm talking money with my pen and my pad. You know I'm swinging when I ride in my slab. Working hard when I get in the lab. If you need a feature from Cleave, then you gotta pay up when you get in the cab. I'm finna get me a bag. Feeling good, finna get me a jag. Order the food and send me the tab. And I'ma pay like I stole from your dad. I am a vulture for cash. I'm about to get me about a hundred bands in the bag. But I'm not done, I get more. I'm about to get me another hundred bands in the bag. You win the big as a plan. I'm feeling cool like a fan. Pit bull in the lab. Keep the tool in my slab. My chick yellow like a cab. I got the mag in my hand. With some bands in my hand. Rubber bands on the cash. And a stash for the cash. Man, I'm getting me a bag. I'm finna get me a bag. I'm finna get me a bag. Pick it up. Yeah, 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 what's good, what's good? It's your boy Ill Flow Spitter, a.k.a. Cleve the Venom, coming out that ace time, Houston, Texas, Southwest, man. It's that Closet TV where I bring you the news from the closet, man. Yeah, let me get straight up into this thing, man. I got things to do. I got things to do. You know what I'm talking about? So, yeah, let me get straight into this thing, man. Your boy Anthony Joshua is supposed to be fighting Andy Ruiz. Now... This is this, 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 this is this is so this this is really starting to do something to me, dog. It's the Anthony Joshua is really 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 starting to concern me, fam. You know, um, his demeanor, fam. Anthony Joshua's demeanor, bro, is that of a teddy bear, fam. And I ain't even trying to talk down on him. He's a very respectful dude. He knows how to talk when it comes to being respectful and polite and nice. He's a very nice guy, fam. But fam, this is boxing. You cannot sit here and be talking like that, bro. You cannot be talking like that. You're talk Anthony Joshua was talking as if he has absolutely no confidence. Like he's just gonna go in there and well, I just pray for when or I hope that this is gonna happen for me. Or I hope that I fam, you don't even sound like a warrior. Like you sound like a nigga who was walked into boxing like a motherfucker just gave you t a title. You know what I'm saying? I've seen his highlights. He was doing his thing, but damn, fam. Damn, dog. Like you, 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 dog, Anthony Joshua, man, you really pissing me off with this friend with this nice friendly stuff, bro. You too nice, man. You too friendly, bro. You gotta stop that, man. You're nothing like Lennox Lewis. When I'm not talking about skill-wise and boxing-wise, I'm talking about demeanor-wise. Cat's not even taking you serious now, bro. You you've been running from Wilder for, for how long? Now you're saying that you're not even interested in Wilder, even if you do beat Andy Ruiz. What the hell? That don't even make sense. So you're not interested in Wilder, even if you do beat Andy Ruiz? Oh, hell to the now, bro. Then every time somebody asks you a question about how confident you are to get these belts back, you sit there and you sound like the most nicest, friendliest person ever. And that's not, that don't, that don't, that don't match with boxing, bro. It don't match with promoting your fight, bro. That that don't match with the energy that you're supposed to be displaying when it comes to promoting your fight and being the the the, the you know uh, having a um, confidence at an all time high, having the most ultimate confidence that you could possess, and you sitting up there sounding like some some. Just, I don't know, man. It's like, it's cool to be respectful. I, to be honest with you, we need more people like Anthony Joshua when it comes to living out, and you know, just just people skills and social skills and know how to talk to somebody and shit, you know, stuff like that. But fam, it's a time and place for everything when it comes to your professional sport, man. You a boxer, bro. You supposed to be on fire, bro. What I mean by on fire is you supposed to be talking that ish. And you don't have to be cussing and doing a whole bunch of crazy stuff. But there's a way you can get your message passed without you even cussing or without you even saying nothing bad. Just be confident, fam. Or do you not think that you're going to win? Because they asked him, do they think he's going to win? And he's talking about he just has to go in there and see. Or he just have to go in there and see and just box. Or he just have to go in there and see and just box. What? Fam, dog, you have to go in there and see and just box? Fam, my nigga, but no, bro. The, the, the only way Anthony Joshua gonna beat Andy Ruiz is if he goes in there and do the same thing he went in there the first time that got that knocked him out. Just make adjustments on what caused you to get knocked out a few times. You shouldn't have really traded all that weight either. I don't think he should have lost that weight. I don't think Anthony. I don't think Andy Ruiz should have lost weight either, like that. You've been fat all this time. You know what I'm saying? You should stay in the same weight. Just being. 
excellent condition, but just stay the same size. You've been doing that all this time. So why are you lowering your weight? Why are you losing weight? Why are you shedding weight for? You know what I'm saying? But, hey, man, only robot, I'm not a boxer. Only a boxer can or a trainer can, t can tell you that. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, man, it's your boy, Ilflo Spitter, man, out there H-Town, Houston, Texas, Southwest, man. It's that Closet TV where I bring you the news from the closet. Y'all leave in the comment box and let me know if y'all think that Anthony Joshua is like a teddy bear dude. And I'm not saying soft, like a bitch, and none of that, excuse my language. But I'm talking about boxing confidence. Does he sound confident? Leave in the comment box. Does he sound confident? Does he sound like he's just too nice? Which is okay to be nice, man, but you gotta be ferocious in the ring or when it comes to promoting. When you're promoting, you're not nice. When you're in the ring, you're not nice. Those two things right there. You can be nice after the victory. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? So come on, Anthony Joshua. Hopefully this boosts you up a little bit. I'm not trying to tear you down. I'm not trying to talk ish about you, man. I'm just saying, man, you need to show more confidence, bro. Straight up. Lennox Lewis barely even smiles. I'm out.